So now let's see how we can work around with the image size inside of Pixlr E. So here you can see that I have an image and if I were to go around onto the image menu, then you can see image size is an option. Once I click on image size, you can see that I can redefine the within height of the image that I have right here. So right now is uh, 1280 by uh, 853. So if I want to go around and then change this to let's say for example, around 800 pixel, you can see that the height changes accordingly. That is because the constraint proportion is there. Once I click apply, you can see that the image size just changes out right there. So now you can see that the image size is lower. I can go around into image size and increase the image as well. Let's say, for example, if I were to do 4000 and press apply, it does increase the image size, but now the pixelation is there because you're not actually adding in more details onto it. You're just expanding the pixels that are just uh, pre-existing. So I'm going to go to image size and I'm just going to change this around to 500. But let's say, for example, if you want to define the height manually, then you can disable the constraint proportion option. So you can go down, let's say, for example, 500 by 2, uh, 320, but it does distort out the image a bit. So you have to be careful while using that option and uh, be careful not to distort out the image too much. Let's say, for example, I can go around and do something like 400 right here constant proportion, let's say 400 by 400, press apply, you can see that the image gets squeezed out right here. So I'm going to go around into image size, I'm going to disable the constant proportion, let's just go around and type in 600 right here. And then you can enable and disable the smoothing. So if you disable the smoothing, the anti-aliasing is not applied. So the image is much more harsher looking. So depending on what type of a result you want, you can work accordingly. And that is how you can work around with the image size option inside of Pixlr E. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.